All right, here's where we get to have a little fun. We're going to use a new tool called the Follow Me tool. This guy right here. It's a little tricky, but we can do some really neat stuff. These legs are pretty bland, just squares. So we're going to change them. I'm going to pick a leg. I'm going to edit that leg. So I've got the edit box here. I want to draw on this leg. If I start drawing over here, you'll notice it starts putting lines in weird places. We're drawing on the wrong leg. We want to draw on the leg we've chosen. So we can use our line tool. A um, good rule for this though is if this is the center line, we don't want to go past the center line. So I'm going to draw on this side. I'm going to draw a line and make sure it says on face. And you'll notice it's doing it to the other three legs at the same time. We can use our arc tool. Um, we can, uh, again, making sure it says on face. Maybe go up all the way up to there. Okay, so we've got a simple shape there. Uh, if I try pushing that, you'll notice it does it to all of them. That looks kind of cool, but um, it, it's only on one side. Let's fix that. Two ways to use the follow me tool. I'm going to do it the hard way first. So the follow me is like the push pull. So if I click here, I'm going to push pull along this edge and you can see it doing that. The difference is it just turned the corner. Okay. So if you see it's following it all the way around. We push pulled it all the way around that square and I click again. And we did push pull on all four sides. That's one way to do it. So again, we click, not holding the mouse button down, we follow it around the shape we want it to go around, in this case it's that square, and we click. Okay, there's a faster way to do it. We, can, we want it to go around this square, so I select it. See the edges? We want it to go around those edges. We leave that selected, I come get my follow me tool, and it disappears, but it's still there. So if I click here, it does it automatically. One more time, we select it so the edges are selected. Follow me tool and click. And that's the follow me tool. You can do all kinds of fun stuff with that.